What's poppin' homies? It's your boy Nitty back in the building. Yo, I'm en route to Miami. Actually, I'm taking a little break right now. Um, I should be there in an hour. Unfortunately, I'm gonna get there. I'm gonna arrive when the store opens. We're going to the new Nike store in Aperture Mall. I've been to Miami twice and they've been building that store, remodeling it, doing whatever they're doing. And I got one that is gonna open today. So I'm making the trip down south, man. So we're gonna make it. Hopefully I get in a good spot in line. I'm 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 expecting it's supposed to be around the block, man. Cause I know the store in my area, when it first opened, it was the lines was crazy. And Miami's a lot bigger, at least in my personal opinion, than than Orlando. At least the sneaker culture that is. But nevertheless, man, enough talking. Let me just get back on the road, man. I'll see y'all in a bit. Peace. All right, guys. I finally made it. But um, I'm roughly an hour late, man. It wasn't planned, but that's how it worked out. But anyways, man, let's go in the building and see what's popping. I got my camera with me. Hopefully we can get some good footage, man. See what's like, see what the crowd's like, and what's really happening. So I just ran to a few people, man. They say uh, it's about 30 people left in line. They say it's best to go through the second floor. So that's what we're about to do, second floor. The line is not that bad, y'all. It's literally about 11 people in line. We got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I am number 10. Damn, he is loud as hell, y'all. But anyways, man, we in the building. Look like this is a women's floor. Yeah, most deaf. This is the women's floor. Man, let's go to the men's. That's DJ Nasty, Orlando's very own, y'all. He's also sponsored by Soul Premise. I'm gonna rap with them later, man, but let's go and check some uh, shoes out. See, I know the men's is gonna be crazy, man. Women's floor wasn't that packed but downstairs man it is crazy down here it is crazy packed take a look at some running shoes trail runners we don't know nothing about them so we're gonna skip that let's go look at some air maxes for his lifestyle man this is what they got air forces now some of these i haven't seen before like this joint you got the wheat the golden harvest joints that's different tons of tech fleece so my camera even picking that up tech fleece is on deck they got the shorts the pants black navy blue oh even the brown joint oh these are tight i like these let's take a look at the retro so these are retros in the building the canary one lows heritage want to be uh mid uh, off white all right these are all right. four of those iris threes these came out a long time ago and they still got them well it just opened so it's expected man that's it for retros y'all guys look what they got i like these 97s yo these are tight 185 damn kind of pricey though it's not outlet prices All right, so these are LeBron's they got, LeBron 20s. These are cool, I actually like these. Definitely like these, but there's one other colorway that's coming out uh, for December, is the Grinch. I would love to get that. I'm not mad at them. And then you got the Zoom Freak 4s in the building. What are these? Air Zoom GT Cut 2s. These are different. Here's another look at the Jordans, man. They got the 3s, they got the 1s, and the Pollen 1s. I expect more, to be honest with you. And towards the bottom, we got some 95s, but it's all white though. 175 is the price and i'm not mad at these joints either these are cool these are different 185 is the price again these are not outlet prices y'all this is nike retail prices and what in the world is these look like a hubcraft yo <laughs> vapor hubcraft max they got them in black too the audacity them to make two of them not a fan and lastly the pennies man i hope this could show up a lot better than the previous video i was shooting earlier uh penny ones man or air max pennies the white joints I'm gonna acquire about them. Oh, there's another pair too at the bottom. These are cool, but obviously all these would be impulse buy if I have to purchase. 140 for these joints. Arachis on the side. We're gonna fall through and see what else they have in the building. These are the Air Force ones I shown earlier, but here's some other versions. The gray joint, the all white joint, and these are the 40th anniversaries. We took a look at these New Orleans joints, the 504 Erico in the back hill, Gold Foil and the Nike Air on the back, but Dazzle Swoosh, cause they're doing too much. And the Lebray 6, oh, 504 Lebray. These are KDs, the on pearl joints. I like those. Oh, shit. Had to drop a shoe. All right, here we go. There you go. These are LeBron 20s. I'm not mad at them, though. Oh, we saw those. What are these right here, though? What are these? 
So there's a Nike by you section that we saw in New York in the Invasion store. They do the same thing here. I apologize if it's super, super loud. But anyways, you grab a sweater, some shoes, Air Force One. Grab a Heather Gray sweater, crew neck, or a green crew neck, or even a t-shirt. And have them, like, design it for you. These are some of the designs. Miami, Aventura 305, et cetera. Oh, back here, they got heat on, yo. So you got some Dunk 11s, UNC 1s, Travis Scott 1s all the way in the back. Here we go again with that picnic blanket hoodie, man. Hard right, pass. Oh, and they got it a different color? Nah. Okay. We got the shag pullover. I like this. What's the quality feeling like? Quality's okay. Oh, you got the flight hoodie, wash, maroon joint, long sleeve, flight tour. Not mad at it. Yo, I seen these jackets in the outlet. What else they got? Got some khaki, uh, I don't even know. Standard fit, taper leg. Got some pullovers. Ooh, you got the knit t-shirts. I like these. This reminds me of the ACG. I have seen these in the outlet as well. The 40 beans here. And you got them a different color. More Jordan tees, Nike tees. Oh, when did Nike start putting a patch at the bottom of their, uh, of their tees? That's cool. That's a different look. Oh, yeah. Finally, I found an outfit that would go with the brotherhoods, y'all. This joint goes with the brotherhoods. Finally, we found a tee, y'all. Actually, match. What y'all think, man? It matches? I'm moving past that. Obviously, they got to have a Miami jersey in the building. Book bags, basketballs, more pullovers. This is different, though. Little distressed look going on. Okay, he got the LeBrons on. I ain't mad at it. Dry fit. What is this? Is this a hybrid? Like a dry fit tech fleece? Oh, but look at the zipper. It's not taper. I call it the taper zipper with the, the black outline. Now, this is an exposed zipper, man. Not a fan. Do got a hoodie. Long drawstring. That's ridiculous. Now, these shorts was ridiculous, y'all. But you know what? I ain't mad at it. They're so different. I gotta get a size that will actually rock. It's crazy looking, man. Yo, this is a hairy short, yo. What is this? Wool? Loose fit. Mid-tight length. I ain't mad at it. I definitely will rock this. It's not even the Jordans or Nike. How much is he going for? All right, cool, cool. Man, I appreciate it. I thought you forgot about me, man. Nah, nah, nah. Uh, I heard y'all busy back there. You also taking photos, too, or what? Yeah, I'm trying. You can't do it with... Yeah. You guys got bags I can put this in while I walk around, or nah? Honestly, appreciate it, bro. All right, guys. So here's a sneak peek of, uh, oh, that's totally overexposed. Guys, these are fire. Should I get them, man? I've been talking about it for so long. I saw these at the last minute, yo. Damn. It'll be an impulse buy, though, for the most. They're 125, man. But I do like them, man. I love that little touch of yellow hit on the Nike tag. Uh, credit card. Guys, they also got some black and white dunks in the building. I'll show you at UNC and yellow dunk. Here's the black and white. There's no red on the Nike tag, so it's not a panda. Just a black and white, man. The price, 125, man. If y'all interested, if they're still here, it's FYI. There's another dunk, y'all. Yo, hope this music is not too loud for y'all, because it's blazing in here, man. There's Nike by you again. T-shirts. There goes the machine. Oh, okay. Here goes the Air Force system. This is what you can do to it. I appreciate it, man. Aventura, you got Dices, Nike. So this is the homies, man. He designed this. 305. It's a hoodie. 305 on the back. Nice. Fire. Nike. But look on the back. Okay. Nice. It says amateur with the swoosh. Fire. I'm going to get you doing your thing, all right? Huh? I'm going to get you doing your thing. All right. Yeah. yeah, yeah. All right, so we're in the women's section. This is the Jordans. This is what they got. They got some dunks, some pink ones, mids, lows, 312s, and then those. These different over here. The gold cements, hard path. The wannabe pollen mids, the yellow and white joints. Those are cool, though. These are different. 97s, 185. So different, yo. Even the material. Like canvas, maybe. Air Max section. These are trainers over here. Ain't nothing really crazy. Nothing that I recognize. Guys, I really can't vlog up here because I don't know what I'm looking for. A whole bunch of women stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you don't want me showing that. Oh, kids over here. Back here, you got some uh, plus size mannequins with some leggings. Yeah, it's different. I don't know what I'm looking at, man. Oh, but this jacket is fire, though. Forget the sex. That jacket is fire. Oh, it's a hoodie. I'm not mad at it. Looks dope. Hope it's showing up on the camera. Tone that down a little bit. Go the other way. There we go. Hope that's better, man. That, that jacket is fire. Or a hoodie. Pullover. Whatever. Probably expensive, too. All black Air Forces. You got the green joints. Ah, uh, those are different. You got the high Air Force ones. Real talk, y'all. I'm in. I'm not shopping <laughs> in the women's clothing but this is fire man i love the material very soft it's very stretchable man i love that material i like to see that in men jordan one's in the building we got another vlogger
guys, what's crazy is Adidas is right next to Nike, man. <laughs> That's going to be tough. That's going to be real tough for Adidas. Yo, this is Tesla's roll, y'all. When I came here, there was only like five cars. Now, it's like a fleet of them. <laughs> it's crazy, Pat. But anyways, guys, man, that's pretty much it for the Aperture Mall Nike Grand Opening. It was cool. Met some people that I haven't seen in a while. That was dope. Met some people from out of state that watch the channel. Met some new people, new friends, you know what I mean? But nevertheless, guys, um, I do got to head back home. There's like two shoe stores in the mall. I don't got time to do that because I want to stop at another Nike outlet that I haven't visited in a long time, probably over a year. So I'm going to do another vlog with that and route home. So I'm going to grab, refuel, get some water, you know what I mean? Because now I'm drinking a lot of water. <laughs> and um, I'll see y'all in the next video. All right, matter of fact, now I'm going to take you out to the crib and I'll show you guys what I picked up, man. I did pick something up. It wasn't for me, but I'll show you guys anyways. Guys, I told you I was grabbing some water. Yo, as I pull up to Publix, it's literally a Publix across the street from the mall. Nike have little outdoor festivities, man. They got like a soccer goal, some basketball rims. Let's pull up and see what's popping, man. You like that having some fun. Yeah, man, I'm stepping all in the grass in these shoes. Probably not the best idea. So pretty much they giving out smoothies and food and dessert, y'all. I just got me a mango, strawberry, banana smoothie. I know I said it backwards. Let's shoot some hoops while I wait. I was just shooting some basketball while waiting for my smoothie. It's free. Guys, I think I pulled my hamstring. <laughs> Try to kick that damn soccer ball, bro. I haven't been back to the court in months, man. So, damn. Kind of hurt. But anyways, man, <laughs> we'll wrap it up at the curve. Yeah, 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 so I got up early in the morning and I drove down there by myself, Dolo, because I wanted to see what that grand opening was looked like. I wanted to see what was in the building. What possibly could Nike offer for this location? Since this is a upscale mall, it's definitely an upscale mall, guys. The mall is banging, man. The mall is banging. Now, I've been there several times. Every time I've been there, I always see that Nike on the first and second floor with like borders showing it's coming soon, coming soon. But I never got word on when it was coming until 24 hours before this vlog was shot. In the building, I ran to a lot of you guys, man, from down south that travel, some employees, whatever. Appreciate you guys, man. Thank you. Thank you for watching and supporting. And also, I know you guys want to see what I cop. I technically did not cop anything for myself. I cop something for the homie, the homie who support this channel immensely. You always look out and give me shoes so I can review and show you guys. I had a blessing, man. He asked, I deliver. So here's a few shoes that he cop that I assist him with. Let me show you guys. Peep the label. Wait, one of my sizes, but not for me, obviously. Glide out. These are the Air Max pennies. Y'all see that one set in the back heel? The Nike swoosh on the tongue. Predominantly all white shoe with white laces and a little bit of hit of blue and that swoosh jewel on the lateral side, man. Air bubble visible unit on the back heel. You also got a jewel swoosh right above the toe box area and a big old blue swoosh on the outsole, predominantly white outsole. Cool shoe, 
I don't need it. Happy to help the homie get it. He's a big supporter, big fan. He's from Orlando. He loved Orlando Magic. It's not me so much, but it is what it is, man. Size 11 and a half. This was retail. Next. Oh, you guys are going to love this. Peep the label. These are size 11. Clearly not my size, but if this was the last pair and I won this shoe, I would have made it happen. I would be rocking these. Flat out. These are the Air Jordan 1 High OG Pollens. Now, I do have a pair in my collection. Salute to Cool Kicks for assisting me all the way from Cali, all the way from the West Coast, man. You know, I'm a big Jordan 1 fan, and you know I didn't get the shoe, so he delivered. And I have it in my collection, my size. This clearly is not my size. There's no need to double up. This is not the taxis, but um, this is for the homie size 11. He wear 11 and Air Jordan 1s. I like this shoe, man. I definitely like this shoe. It does remind me of a bit of the Oka ones which i have in the closet i'm not gonna bring it out man just imagine or google it <laughs> or if you have it you know the best hand in the game pack the yellow version this is that just my this way this is uh leather guys that's pretty much it man i enjoyed my trip I had some fun i uh, hanged out the mall for like a couple hours also outside they had another festivity going on they had like a i was, I was gonna call it pickup truck what do you call those like a food truck they was giving out free smoothies, man. I think they have food as well. I, I politely pass on the food. It's been a while since I got back on the court, man. But I, uh, you know, shot some few few hoops. I think I made a few baskets, even from long range. Soccer, I made one goal, and it was not captured on camera, unfortunately. But trust, I did make it in one of those holes. Pause. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for supporting, man. And yes, I got the ball in the budget hoodies. And guess what, man? It's only right. It's only right. I'm sorry I have to say this towards the end. Maybe I clip this and put it somewhere in the video. If you guys are interested in these hoodies, pull up to MrBallInTheBudget.com and purchase you one. And you already know the theme of this channel. We like to save deals and or we like to get deals and steals. So I'm going to offer, am I going to do 40? Am I going to do 50? The price is going to be on the website. I think it's going to be hedging between 40 to 50% off, man. I'm going to do the crew next, which you see over here, and the hoodies. It's going to be significantly discounted. If I can find anything else I can discount, throw it on there, I'll do it as well. When it's gonna happen, you gotta give me some time. I think I'm gonna get it going live. I think I got some time tomorrow. Wait, no, it's a shoe dropping tomorrow. If you guys willing to do that, I mean, I'm not telling you to postpone or delay your shopping elsewhere, but yeah, come back and support the homie, man. Let's do it Thursday. I have this thing popping off for y'all, man. Heavily discounted hoodies and crew necks. You're gonna love these hoodies and crew necks, guys. I love them. I love them. Anyways, I'm rambling. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.